Hi guys, welcome. Danny here from the Magic Junk Drawer. Okay, so the time I pulled my back out, I had never had back pain before, ever. And it was a day where I had to be at work, like the bookkeeping shift on Saturday. I think it started at 3.45, 3.45 to 11. So that morning I got up, I remember, I did an abs workout, I was painting my kitchen, and I was vacuuming. Those were the three things I remember doing, and I don't know what did it. But whatever did it, after I got out of the shower, my lower back started to hurt. So I'm like, all right, I'll be okay. I got to work, and the floor was so hard. Standing on that floor tend, was tending to start to like exacerbate the problem. Like Now all of a sudden, I was having a hard time standing up, up straight, excuse me. And then I was having a hard time, like, I was having to alternate feet. I couldn't stand on both feet. I had to alleviate the pressure. A couple of hours into the shift, I couldn't even stand anymore. I mean, at one point, I was on all fours in the office, and I had tears rolling down my eyes. And my one friend that worked with me, um, he opened up the door, and I was like, I tears. And he was like, oh, my God. He used to call me Brittany McJiggles. So don't ask how hey, you came up with that name. Britney after Britney Spears. Um, anyway, and he was like, oh my God, Britt, do you want me to take you to the hospital? And I was like, I got laughing, but crying and in such pain. I was like, no, 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 I'll be okay. So I took those like bare back and body and I'm one of those people, like I never take anything. So when it wasn't working for me, I'm like, I knew something was seriously wrong. Now this was Saturday night. I wasn't gonna be able to get to a chiropractor till at the very least Monday. How was I getting through the weekend? So I sucked it up. I got to work. I was very careful about consuming anything liquid because the bathroom was so far away and up that crazy flight of stairs. And what I did was I laid on, laid on the floor. And you wanna know what the funniest thing is? Lying on the floor, a guy could give instructions to the cashiers. Well, I had him working with me, so he was a big help. But if one of the kids came over, I could tell them the buttons to hit and get them do the transaction with the customer. But the funny thing was is that customers would come over to the desk and they could sense that there was somebody there. And I would sense that they came over to the desk and I'd be like, I'm okay. How can I help you? And they would be like, oh my God, where are you? I'm like, my back is pulled out. I'm okay. I can help you. Tell me what you need. It was hysterical. But it's like you suck it up. You do what you got to do. One foot in front of the other and you get things done. And that's what happened. I managed the store from lying on the floor behind the courtesy desk that night. I wasn't laying on the floor. I was kind of like on all fours. Like that was like the most comfortable I could get. And I was able to give enough direction to the other people. The worst was when I would have to go to the bathroom because standing on the floor and climbing those stairs was a disaster. It was so painful. Getting in and out of the car was really painful too. But then by Monday I got to the chiropractor and things started to um, get back to normal a little bit. And let me tell you something, my back has never been the same since I pulled it out. That old injury does arise every now and again, but it has not bothered me at all as bad now that I'm not working standing on that hard floor anymore. So there's another reason why I shouldn't be working in that store. All right, if you like what we're doing here at the Magic Junk Drawer, don't forget to like and subscribe, and we will see you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.